Hey guys, it's Brad here at Doogie's Dugout, and today I've got a couple things I want to touch base on. Um, I do have a package that I need to rip open that I was in a break, and my PSA J-Rod short print is in here too. So um, I want to open this up. I have uh, one little bit of fan mail that I want to open up too for the channel. I keep forgetting to, to show you guys, and... One last thing, I do want to bring up the Boombox Elite Baseball um, about what happened to me with that, with this. And for all you new people who are not aware of how this subscription box works, I will go more into detail about my experience and let you know how my Elite Boombox went down. But for now, for first off, let's do... Uh, this fan mail I received it in the mail. I keep forgetting to read it on air, but um, it was from Brian. He says, "Hey, just wanted to say congratulations on all of those subscribers and views. You are really building a following. Encloses a small amenity. Doogie's dugout has got everything: tops, Bowman, Mega Packs, blasters." That thing where you and Lucas face off to see who has better pulls. Spud Webb's rookie card. Keep that content flowing, Brian. So I thought it was pretty cool that he would send that. And if you guys know SNL and Stefan, how he does the... Oh, that has everything. So when I opened this up, it was pretty funny. I thought it was very humorous and very witty. So thank you, Brian, for that. I appreciate that. Um, the next thing I want to touch on is... The Elite Boombox. I've bought this. Um, I usually go with the mid end, but I challenged uh, a YouTuber, Jose from Mr. Nice Guy Baseball Cards. He accepted the challenge. So when I saw Jabs rip his boombox open, he had seven packs. So you would think with that huge following that Jabs has, that he's going to open up this product. He's going to promote it, correct? So he's going to open this up. Whatever you use inside is what you're going to get if you order a boombox. Well, that's not how this works. He opened up his boombox. He received seven packs. This was a $260 boombox here. I opened up my boombox. I received six packs. So I'm like, okay, why did I only get six? So Jose opened up his boombox. He got seven. So that's when I reached out to the boombox. I explained the situation. Their response back was, thanks for reaching out. 50% of the boxes this month had a pack of 2022 Bowman or a 2022 Gypsy Queen. So basically saying half the boxes had either a Bowman pack or Gypsy Queen pack. And the other packs, the other 50% didn't have those packs. So he's saying also, the boxes we ship are random. I am sorry you didn't receive an extra pack this month, and I appreciate you ordering from us again. Our Elite boxes contain 6 to 10 packs and a one-touch. Some boxes will have less than others, unfortunately, but we will try to keep the featured products that everyone gets high in value to the box before taxes and shipping. Let me know if you have any other questions and thoughts for me. So when I got that email back, I'm thinking to myself, how is that even fair? Like you got, you're shipping jabs, an elite box. Okay. He opens it up on air. He whips it out and says, okay, oh, this month's September month, you get this pack, and you get this pack, and you get that pack, you get this pack, and you get this pack, and this pack, all for $260, right? No, that's not how it goes. So basically what he just told me, well, though, because that, that shorter pack that I didn't get, Jose got a Bowman pack, Jab's got a Gypsy Queen pack, I didn't get an extra pack, so... Am I being a baby over a $15, $12, $10, $10 hobby pack? Well, you darn right I am because this is an expensive box, okay? So when you spend $260 plus tax and shipping, you got $285 under your belt, and you see Jabs open up his box, and he's got seven packs. 
I open up mine, I've got six. So that's like me going to my local card shop. You're in front of me, let's say. You order, you say, you tell the guy behind the counter, hey, I want this pack, this pack, this pack. It comes out to seven packs. And okay, your total is $285. Have a nice day. My, I'm next in line. I said, hey, you know what? I'm interested in those packs too. Give me those same seven packs that he ordered. And he tells you, no, you can only have these six packs. And, and by the way, we're, just, we're still going to charge you $285. How would you feel? So I just want everybody to be aware of when you're ordering from the Elite Bot or the Boom Box that they can short you or they can give you more. They, it's up to them, basically. It's random, he says. So you guys just, I just want you guys to be aware of that. So don't make the same mistake I did. If you guys think, if you guys think that's cool, it's a good idea to do that, then by all means, go for it. I'm just telling you my experience and how it kind of rubbed me the wrong way. I told him I wasn't happy with, I, I emailed him back and I said, I don't know why or how this is even possible, why you'd even promote your business like this. But I mean, if this is the way he runs his business, that's fine. That's cool. I just want people to know that not all boxes, elite boxes will contain the same stuff and for that month. So there's my rant. I just had to get that out. And it's, it was kind of bothering me because I still hadn't said anything about it, but it, it still kind of leaves a little bad taste in my mouth for sure. But, and you would think they would make it right by saying, okay, we're sorry. We'll end up sending you an extra pack. Be on the lookout. But no, it's just like, I told him, I said, I'm not coming back to you guys. You just lost a customer and they didn't even respond back. So if that's how they want to treat their customers, they're, you know, I'm a returning customer too. So, but I won't be returning. So, all right, done with that now. So if you guys have experienced any kind of negative feedback or from the boom box, let me know. I'm just kind of curious what you guys think on that topic. But let's, let's dive into the meat and potatoes here. This is from Dustin over at One Cent Sports Cards. I am a Patreon member for him, and I bought into a break. He had the new museum collection, and it was two museum boxes, and I think it was a Bowman Light Draft, 2021 Bowman Draft Light, and um, I think one of the 3D packs that just came out from Tops. And it was a random team break. It was thirty dollars per team, you know, per uh, per buy-in. So, so one team gets you a random, or one is thirty bucks. So, I had a ten dollar credit that from my Patreon. So, really, it only cost me twenty bucks to get in, plus the four fifty shipping. So, twenty four fifty is what it cost me. And when he did the randomization on his uh, live show I ended up getting the angels and I was just like oh my gosh are you serious like of all team I got my team so I was stoked <clears throat> so he told me I got the angels or you know I was watching I was like holy cow I can't believe I got the angels so needless to say Oh, there was the J Rod. I, I didn't see it though. I'm gonna have to get something to cover this up. Um, but yeah, I do have the J Rod. He also sent in my J Rod short print to PSA so I can get it graded. And like, I'm new to this sending in the PSA stuff. I'm not, I'm a novice. I'm real, I have no idea what I'm doing. I tried to do it on their website, and it's just a pain. And one of the things that Dustin does for his Patreon members is he sends off cards to PSA for free. He, I mean, you, got, you pay the fee, the normal fee, but he sends off no, no extra charge, no nothing. So I said, hey, Dustin, can you send off my J-Rod short print? He said, sure, let's, let's do it. So he sent it off. <clears throat> so 
Um, that's in this package here too. It's right here. Here's the J-Rod short print. I will reveal that. And I will also reveal what I got on, as my hits for the break. So let's start things off. We have... Oh, I also had the the Rangers in the break too. So I bought two two break two uh, teams, random teams. So here's uh, Luis Angel Acuna at a 250. At a couple, there's the Ian Moeller, but that's not a numbered. It's just a refractor, and then a Cameron Colley. And then I have some base cards here that for the Rangers and the Angels. <clears throat> So, but here's the museum collection. So, to lead things off, man, I want to kind of cover some stuff up. So, he pulled this Anthony Rendon, 72 out of 150. So, I was, I was happy with that when he pulled. I was like, all right, cool. I'll take that. So, and then the next hit that he pulled was... A Jared Walsh dual patch auto at a three ninety nine, I believe. Yeah, eighty three at a three ninety nine. So I was, I was like, oh man, this is awesome. I can't believe he's pulling these angels for me. That's awesome. That's that's great. So then, are you guys ready? He ended up pulling this for me. The Mike. Trout Museum Collection Auto out of 50. A $24, 24 50 buy in, basically 25 buck buy in. And he pulled this is my first Mike Trout Auto. So there's his stamp of, right there. One cent sports cards. He's an awesome dude. Dustin is great. If you guys ever want to buy into his breaks or you want to be a become a patreon member it i pay 15 dollars a month to be a patreon member <clears throat> and he uh he gives you a 10 dollar credit break every month so basically it's five bucks you know because you get a 10 dollar credit break to be a patreon member and like i said he's got perks he's got the psa like he did this for me for free all i had to do is pay the sh the the PSA fee to get it graded. So I'm going to do the reveal on this. So on what I got on it. So here's the, if you guys saw the video when I pulled it, this was actually the video where I was kind of stunned and I was like, oh my gosh, I got to go get a top. I got to go get a one touch. And I actually hit stop on the video. But <clears throat> um, I'll post I'll try to put that in the link like up here somewhere or over there. I can't. Um, I'll try to do that. But um but yeah, here here's the reveal. Let's see what this came back as. So we have 2022 tops, short print 659, Juliar Rodriguez. It came back in mint nine. Well, the only guess the only thing I can think of that maybe it didn't come back was maybe it's bottom heavy. But the corners look good. But it is a mint, it is a mint nine. So I'm still happy with that. So how about that? You get a J-Rod short print and a Mike Trout auto in the same video from the same guy. I mean, Dustin is so awesome. So... There you have it, guys. There's the uh, <laughs> the package. I'm I'm shaking because I'm so like holy cow! I can't believe what I'm what I'm looking at right here. So this is definitely um, the highlight of the last couple months of me ripping stuff open, which I didn't even rip this open. I ripped the J Rod, but not the trout. The trout, I was like in crying. I was so ha jumping up and down. When he pulled it, I, I couldn't believe it. But uh, I'll leave a link in the description for his uh, channel, One Cent Sports Cards. He's a great dude. Like I said, he he does all the videos on like 
if you want to buy into a, a team, a random team break for when it sets comes out, like he did one for Museum Collection, he did one for, for Topps Chrome just recently. He he tells you what teams to stay away from. He breaks it all down. He does. I mean, he goes through t- fine tooth comb with it, and he'll tell you exactly what to get, what not to get, stay away from. But he's a great dude. Thanks, Dustin. I greatly appreciate it. I'm so happy to be a Patreon member for you. So 15 bucks a month, heck yeah, that's worth it for me. So, But there you have it, guys. Leave a comment below, like, subscribe. I'd like to hear your thoughts on you know, this stuff here, what, what Dustin does. And also, I mean, if you want to talk about the Elite Box, you can. If not, that's cool. I just want to get that out there. And I love the fan mail from Brian. That was awesome. That was a great letter that he sent. So, But there you have it, guys. Thanks for joining me. Leave a comment. I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.